Good morning. I'm Janelle Brown with your morning digital news brief for this Friday, November 17th. Colonial School Board member Dr. Jamina Clay has resigned after controversial comments she made on social media about the Israel-Hamas war. Dr. Clay also works as an assistant superintendent for the school district of Philadelphia, and some parents are calling for Philadelphia schools to take action as well. We're now just six days away from Thanksgiving, but the travel rush is already underway. At Philadelphia International Airport, 900,000 people are expected to travel through the airport over the next five days. And it's race weekend in Philadelphia with a half marathon tomorrow and the Philadelphia Marathon on Sunday. Streets are going to be closed throughout Center City, Fairmount Park, and University City during the weekend, so avoid those areas if you're able to. Let's get you caught up on our next weather forecast. It's going to be chilly for the runners, Kate. It is going to be chilly, Janelle. It's going to get progressively colder throughout the day tomorrow, and then for the marathon runners Sunday morning, it'll be in the 30s as that race kicks off. Today, Nothing chilly about it. In fact, it is the warmest day for quite some time. We'll get to 69 degrees today. Very close to possibly hitting that 70 degree mark. Clouds will be increasing a bit. It all depends on how much sunshine we get. That'll determine just how warm it is able to get today. But tonight, change arrives. A cold front sweeps through overnight. That front doesn't have a doesn't have a lot of rain with it by the time it gets here. But a couple of showers are possible overnight, and then some morning clouds early tomorrow. It'll clear quickly for sunshine, but turning blustery and sharply cold. 55 in the morning, dropping into the 40s by late afternoon. Again, that wind will make it feel colder than it is. There's the front approaching from the west. Coastal system should stay offshore, but you can see how quickly we warm up today into the upper 60s. Still in the low 60s at 5:30 this evening. Your evening commute looks fine, but showers arrive overnight. We'll start tomorrow morning in the mid 50s. There's 6:30 a.m. Still some clouds, but by afternoon the wind picks up, the sun comes out, and temperatures drop into the 40s quickly by Saturday afternoon. Your next seven days from next weather. Again, we've got sunshine for Sunday, but rain arrives Tuesday into Wednesday, and that could slow down your Thanksgiving travel. Janelle, I'll send it back to you. Thank you, Kate. And you can get Kate's up-to-date forecast and the latest stories here on CBSPhiladelphia.com. That's the latest for your morning digital brief. I'm Janelle Burrell. Have a great Friday.